get here eventually, mm -hmm. but we can't guarantee when on days like this. Our friend Jeff with the County Library is back joining us on the show. And Jeff, what is happening over at the library? Well, we got a new thing coming up uh, for all of April. It's called our Seeds Library. It works a lot like a regular library, and uh, we will give people seeds if they come in, and they can harvest the seeds, bring the seeds back, and this thing just kind of reciprocates and keeps going like that. I can't believe how creative yeah. you guys get at the library, and this is what we're now doing. So they get to take something home, bring it back and exchange it, and they just keep going. Yeah, and this thing could live on forever, and all the seeds we give out, they're heirloom seeds, so they're good quality seeds that people are looking for, and we have them at six different branches right now, so there's gotta be a place that's near you. If it ever warms up, I guess we could start um, maybe planting some seeds and, and see what comes out of the ground. Will we be okay if we start planting? You think? I don't know. You're going to have to I mean, ask someone at the Seeds Library. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you have a test or a game for us. Yeah, well, do you okay. want to call it a test or a game? Which oh, one should a you test. A, a test. test? Okay, yeah, so I brought in the, some of the seeds. We have, I think we have something like 20, somewhere in the 20, like two dozen different seeds that you can get. So vegetables, okay. fruits, all kinds of stuff. We're going to go easy. Yeah, We're gonna go start easy. easy. I wonder what this one is. Yeah. I mean, so that's our first This one. one's hard. Really, really <laughs> difficult. One, two, three. Corn. It's corn. Corn. It's corn. That's right. It's corn. corn. Yeah. So you get okay. corn, detassel yeah, the corn. that. All right. Okay. That's so not fun. everything you brought goes to something that we see on the Correct. table. Yeah. And we should say the whole reason that you're doing this is because you want everyone to learn about gardening and self sufficiency. That's the big goal here. Right. And gardening is such a such a great thing to do with your family or on your own. It gives you a sense of accomplishment. It gives you something to do. You watch these plants grow. You take care of them. It's uh, mentally beneficial. And just self-sustainability is, is a wonderful thing as well. There is nothing like going into your own garden, even if you don't have a large area, to say, well, I want a cucumber today. And you pick it out of your garden and you actually eat it in your kitchen. And it seems like they taste better when they come out of your garden too. And they actually do they because do. A, lot of, a lot of vegetables sit for a long time before you eat them and these will be fresh. Yeah, they're fresh. Okay, let's try another. Okay, okay. I'm gonna try another? Okay, yeah. these are some tiny seeds. Wait, that seeds. one's harder. So these are just tiny, tiny seeds. That doesn't even seeds. look like anything. Okay, wait, we don't want to okay, see wait. what it is. Don't read <laughs> oh, it. Oh, I'm not reading read it. it? I'm, no, okay. I'm not reading okay, it. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna guess that that turns into a cucumber. Mm -mm, no? Um, I think this one, I'm not looking at it. Wait, hold on. Um. Let's see. I'm gonna say. Oh, that one's hard. Okay, I'm gonna say radish. Radish. What is oh, it? What is it, Jeff? Carrots. Oh, I was gonna say that. that. Okay. Fine. Follow your yep. instincts. Carrots. Carrots. Okay. 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 Let's try so what about that this one? one? This one looks kind of familiar to me. Yeah, that's a cucumber. Wait, wait. wait it wait. is. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, because it looks like the little seeds inside mm -hmm. a cuke. Okay, I'll say cuke with you. Okay. You cucumbers. Cucumber. Yeah. And it is. Let's Yay. look. Okay. Yep. Cucumbers. Okay. Okay. We're doing pretty well. Okay. Now look at these tiny ones. They look like little poppy seeds, and they're going to grow into something that I don't know if people think is delicious or not. Oh. <laughs> does that does that hint I help was, at all? I don't even know what this is. Is that a turnip? That's the turnip. Okay, yeah. I was so gonna say that that was a radish, yeah. but okay, it, that's the turnip. Okay, these okay. are the darker seeds, yep. and they're tiny. Mm -hmm. So tiny. Okay, so last but not least, then here is the radish That's seed. the radishes. And look how tiny those are, too. Mm. You would never even think that no. these little itsy-bitsy things grow into the delicious veggies that we see before us. Yeah. So, Jeff, we go to the seeds library, and we say we want A, B, and C. We mm -hmm. want cucumbers. We want corn. We take the seeds home. We plant them. Mm -hmm. And then when they grow, we br bring back the seeds? Yeah, that's it. You go that's up. That's it? And, yeah, there's like these little drawers you can pull out, or depending on where you're at, you know, mm -hmm. they'll, they'll give them to you in different ways. But... Um, yeah, you go in, you grab, grab your seeds, and it's not just vegetables. I mean, we have, you know, watermelon and stuff like that as well. Oh, okay, so let's talk about how these are delivered and the locations that we can come in and get them. Sure. Yeah, so we have six different branches. Um, you can get them at our Sandy, our Kearns, our Holiday, our Draper, our Riverton, and our Mill Creek branches. So hopefully there's a place near you where you can come in. It's always free. All of our programs are always going to be free. So you don't have to pay anything for the seeds. Um, there is a limit on the seeds, so don't go in and take, like, all the radishes. Just no, because it's not you're a radish like Home fan. Depot and you <laughs> right, just pick all the, right. all the seeds. But truly, Jeff, what is the message here that we're learning? There are all different types of ways of learning, and kids and families yeah. can participate together and grow and learn something. Yeah, and as you know, we've been, we've been talking about how we like to learn at the library, and that, that's a big part of it. And also, it's just improving the quality of life of people in Salt Lake County, and that's a big part of our mission to make this a better place than it was before we got here. And we think gardening is a good way to do that. A lot of people get a lot of enjoyment out of it. And it, like I said, it doesn't stop there. We have flowers, we have fruits as well. So maybe you don't want to grow a, a vegetable, maybe you don't like to eat vegetables, but you like to look at a pretty flower. So we have those as well. 
Well, and it gives you something to look forward to on these big winter days. So they're going to start growing in about 60 days. Peas, it says here, can take 60 to 70. So as soon as the snow maybe starts to melt, mm -hmm. plant the seeds. Yep. Well, imagine your kids every day checking on the plants or the flowers. Mm -hmm. So that makes it exciting. All right, where can we find more information, Jeff? Sure, just go to thecountylibrary.org slash seeds. Everything you need is right there. Thecountylibrary.org. Thank you so much for helping us learn so much with fun yeah. and growing. And we did pretty well. Yeah, yeah that test. wasn't bad. That okay. wasn't bad. All right. <laughs>